So, if I can have your attention, please. Well, it appears that on Twitter, Charles Barkley, if you know, and I'm sure you do, has said this in part on Twitter, and a lot of people apparently agree with it. So, let's take a look. Hall of Fame basketball player and television personality Charles Barkley shares his thoughts on race and the U.S. political climate during CBS's television coverage of the NCAA Men's Tournament Final Four. During the coverage of the Final Four, Barkley said that I think most white people and black people are great people, but I think our system is set up for our politicians, whether they are Republicans or Democrats, are designed to make us not like each other so they can keep their grasp of money and power. They divide and conquer. And apparently, people like Megan Kelly and Jack Probosbik agree with Charles Barkley. And Jack says, I want to send Charles Barkley a free set of bills while Megan Kelly says Americans are starting to see through this tedious, abdodious attempt to divide us by, by skin color and are rejecting it outright. Good for Charles Barkley. Was, man, I think most white people and black people are great people. I really believe that in my heart. But I think our system is set up where our politicians, whether they're Republicans or Democrats, are designed to make us not like each other so they can keep their grasp of money and power. They divide and conquer. I truly believe in my heart most white people and black people are awesome people, but we're so stupid following our politicians, whether they're Republicans or Democrats. And their only job is, hey, let's make these people not like each other. We don't live in their neighborhoods. We all got money. Let's make the whites and blacks not like like each other. Let's make rich people and poor people not like each other. Uh, let's let's scramble the middle class. I truly believe that in my heart. Dominique Clark says, "My man Charles Barkley, spinning facts out here. Both parties try of making us all hate each other. When in reality, most of us are good people." This person. Ryan Knight says, Charles Barkley understands U.S. politics better than any than every punt on CNN, MSNBC, and Fox News. The overwhelming majority of people co-signing Charles Barkley's tone, death over simplification of racism, seems to have something in common. Hmm. Hashtag can you see it? Tariq Mashid says Charles Barkley said politicians want white and black people to hate each other so they can have power. I could care less if a white person likes me or hates me. As a black person, white people have the ability and the protection to kill me with impunity, and I want that stopped. Buzz Patterson says Charles Barkley is exactly right. Politicians are exactly wrong. And he quote tweeted under Ruth Radusky saying Charles Barkley spinning truth. It's all about the divide and conquer agenda. Larry O'Connor. As an aide, Charles Barkley condemned both Republicans and Democrats for his purposely dividing us along with racial lines. He had to have you know something. Conservatives have cheered for him. Those on the left, he could criticize or say nothing. He called out both. One person whose name is Jason Overstreet has disagreed with him, saying that, Dear Charles Barkley, do you know how I know that what he said about race was really stupid and um mentry and some Mickey Mouse simple Simon both sides bullshit bullshit because everyone who agrees with you is a trash ass Trump supporter. For the record Jason Overstreet I was no longer a Trump supporter when Trump removed the Paris Climate Agreement. 
back in 2018. So there you go. There are two fucking parties. That is reality in America. That is the reality we live in. One side is doing this now. The other side is not. To hell with it. this. Both sides is both sides bullshit. And that is so convenient and catnip for ignorant motherfuckers. And of course he would link. He would link this. The Guardian page that says Georgia's. Black churches are horrified by Republican voter suppression. And you know what? I think I will come to this conclusion here. So what are my thoughts on this? Well, you know, Charles Barkley has got a point because back in the early, earlier days, when this country really started to get really divided. Well, Trump was the elected president and uh, things took a different turn than we expected because every single day for the past four years, Donald Trump has been tweeting and 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 tweeting, and tweeting like no one has ever done before. And the fact that he's been doing this all his life kind of shows how he is capable of things. Trump wanted to divide the country. He wanted to divide both po political sides. Trump really was the center of attention. Because every time he tweets, one politician, possibly from the Democrat side, gets mad at Donald Trump for not doing what a normal president is supposed to do, which is which is work, 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 not tweet, tweet, tweet. And uh, in my opinion, Trump just couldn't do that. He just couldn't even finish what he started. Remember last year? He never even had a plan to stop the virus. His entire team admitted it just a little bit over a few months ago last year, said that they give up trying to save the American people. That's how irresponsible the Trump administration, administration is. And if you can't see that, then I don't know what to tell you. Because that's the whole reason why, alone the past four years, that Donald Trump has tried to divide the country. Every time there's, there's a protest, Trump has to tweet about it, and he divides the country. I just want to make it clear that even though I respect Charles Barkley's take on both Republicans and Democrats, because that could tend to happen a lot. In the past four years, however, I just don't think that the Democrats did most racial division when Trump was in office. But I digress. I mean, again, just for, just to a certain extent, Maybe sometimes both Republicans and Democrats do most of the racial division. And that's all I'm going to say on this.